Let it rain. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was, it was a very exciting prospect for myself and Nathan, Nathan Charles out there on the weekend. I mean, obviously they've, they've been the benchmark over the last 10 years and to be the best, you've got to test yourself against the best and it's, it's, it's a good mark to see where we're at as, a, as an aid as well. So hopefully we can put another strong performance out there on the weekend. Yeah, I guess uh, Eden Park's probably the all like spiritual home to an extent. Like. Um, we really enjoy playing at Suncorp in Brisbane and always have good results there. They always have good results uh, in Auckland. And it's just one of those things in rugby which you can't really explain, but um, it's going to be a tough challenge, but that's what sport's about. Um, each side gets to play home and away and um, you know, the best side will win. Oh, just, just overall and pretty much everything, the, the line out, the scrum around the breakdown. I mean, obviously if we can get one or two percent better than our opposite number that we're playing on the weekend, then that generates a big, a big result. I mean, they're obviously they're never going to lay down and give it to you, so you've got to confront them physically and get up there and make a difference in the team. I don't know. This uh, this Bledisloe series is um, it's a uh, something which we've as a group targeted and uh, feel like with the momentum coming out of the French series, we've got a lot of our patterns and. Um, this you know, same group together and I'm um, feeling quite good about that and uh, you know, unfortunately didn't get uh, the result on the weekend but take a lot from that and uh, just keep moving forward and uh, keep playing footy because uh, we know when we, when we have ball in hand and we play, play good footy we can, we can get good results. Sam, I think your dad also played one test and that's the all back to the boss. Have you spoken much to him about what it was like back on New Zealand? Um, no, not really. I mean, obviously, he, he's told me the stories over the years and stuff like that. But um, he's he's always been supportive and given me the, any advice if I need it. But it's a, it's a very different game these days. And I think the the one thing that's still there is the passion that they have, and it's it's always going to be a tough task. So I'm looking forward to that um, opportunity.